beginning. Hello, and welcome to the Hershey Chocolate Factory Tour. Please really? remain seated at all times and keep your hands, arms, and legs inside the car. Our journey begins just outside the factory, in the dairy fields of Hershey, Pennsylvania. This factory here for one very important reason. Well, that's true. Here at Hershey, it really is all about the milk. In fact, it's the milk that gives Hershey's chocolate its unique taste. And who better to tell you all about it than our official welcoming committee? As you see, it's all about the milk. Oh my god, I'm videotaping this. could be heard. I'm wearing a... I am wearing shoes. Well, girls, let's not get ahead of ourselves. It's true that milk is an important part of the process, but let's start at the beginning, here at the Hershey factory, where the cocoa beans arrive from tropical areas all over the world. From here, the beans... ...computers supervise the... Vampires is going to be like so awesome. Yeah, we're going to be vampires at some point. It might be soon. Foreign matter are Hershey's quality standards are of utmost importance to us. And only oh, after the beans are clean, oh, there's like no one. are they sent on favorite. to our blending machines. What number are we in? Cocoa beans we're have different flavors depending on where they're grown. And blending machines, such as those <laughs> on the left, combine beans from various countries in just the right proportions to maintain that unique like Hershey's what flavor. It gets really hot in here. With the beans blended, they're then set ahead to be roasted in large revolving roasters like this one. The roasted cocoa beans are then ready to move oh on to the next stage of the process. A process that will begin to transform plain cocoa beans into Hershey's milk chocolate. It begins right up ahead with a process known as breaking. With the beans now roasted, they arrive here, at the breaking chamber, where the shells are shattered into tiny fragments. What's left is called the nib, the part of the bean actually used to make chocolate. Are we chocolate. vampire? We're vampires here, right? We're still vampires here. We are, we are, we are. No. The are we? The nibs now pass through milling machines, no! as seen on the left. This grinding We're process vampires. generates Woo! extreme heat, which melts the nib yes. into a liquid <laughs> called chocolate liquid. Ah! Of course, this liquid has no alcohol content. This is the liquid from which all chocolate is made. Next, this large press machine is used to squeeze cocoa butter from the chocolate liquid. This cocoa butter will be added back later in the process to make the chocolate smooth and creamy. I know! Well, now we come to that all-important element, milk. Better to tell us about it than the experts themselves. Well, the gals are right. Yeah, yeah, are. Milk is how Hershey's chocolate what? gets its special flavor oh, and the extra added nutritional value. As the gals say, it's nutritious. In fact, hundreds of farms around this region and thousands oh God, of cows totally supply of a million gallons of milk each and every day. Oh <laughs> You're now in central Maine. That would be so scary. Process. Here in milk, sugar, and like chocolate low. liquor are brought together and mixed in no, just the right proportions okay, to create that special okay. Hershey's taste. Okay? Fine. I'm not going to do with it. As the milk and sugar fine. is combined with cocoa, it's mixed together until it becomes a blend of milk chocolate. We're not, not done yet. We're not From here, the We're liquid chocolate it. leaves the large containers in this chamber, where it will be dried once We're again. Really yes, sugar. that's right. This liquid mixture is now conveyed to dryers, such as the one you see on your left. 
we'll have enough time. The dryer removes excess moisture, which results in chocolate crumb. That's scary. The machine up ahead yeah. adds cocoa butter into the mix, Go. which transforms it into a smooth <laughs> chocolate paste, ready for refining. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to the the Oh my god, it yeah. really does smell like chocolate. All that ah! Shaking, breaking, baking, and flaking. We're finally coming up with perfect <laughs> milk chocolate. But there's still a ways to go before it's finished. On your left is a series of roll refining machines. The refining process grinds the chocolate oh god, until it reaches a uniform and smooth consistency. God, why do you look at that? Next, as seen on the left, the chocolate is further refined by a unique process. Chocolate for up to 72 hours. The material that leaves the crunching process is called chocolate picks. These yeah. machines production lines with over yeah. 1 million chocolate picks per day. Hey, those are the same numbers they were whenever we got here now, before. Are you after all that game? effort, no? we're finally ready to make what? a Hershey's I can't. chocolate bar. I'm afraid. <laughs> we're going to the candy room. They're then cooled yeah. and removed from the mold. The final step before being wrapped. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you and then our milk chocolate made to perfection, we then add peanuts, almonds, Look and other extras like. to create I think a world of chocolate treats. Here you see the completely automated putting the finishing touch on Hershey's world famous chocolate and candy products. Yeah, I got to do it on the camera. <laughs> no, be right. 